Hi there, this is a trap in the Italian Gioco piano and it's called Queen Mate in the corner. White opens e4, e5, knight f3, knight c6. After bishop c4 and bishop c5, the Gioco piano, the Italian. White continues with a quiet move, d3. And already in this position, black goes wrong. Sometimes we're led astray by, by fear. And perhaps black is afraid to play the obvious move, knight f6. This is a move preferred by Gary Kasparov. Black might not like the idea of bishop g5, the immediate pin. However, rather than play knight f6, black can play the prophylactic, h6, perfectly acceptable in this position, as is the move d6. But if black goes astray with knight g e7, then white is almost winning after the immediate knight g5 targeting f7 with the assistance of the bishop on c4. And black really doesn't have too much. Black's best defense here would be d5, but after e takes d5, white is certainly in the ascendancy. And black can go wrong even more by defending f7 with castles, because now another important piece can join the attack. That piece being the queen, queen h5, not only adds more pressure to f7, but more importantly is hitting the pawn on f7 with an immediate checkmate. So black can either throw in a spite check with bishop b4, that does nothing, or defend with h6. But now white's winning after knight takes on f7. That's hitting the queen. If rook takes on f7, then queen takes f7, and white is certainly winning. And if black tries queen h8, sort of pinning the knight against white's queen, then white is winning after the attractive knight takes on h6. That's a double check. And after king h7, now the knight returns back to f7 with a discovered check by the queen on h5. The king has to move to g8. And now, as the title of this trap suggests, queen mate in the corner, it's queen h8, and that's checkmate. So this has been queen mate in the corner in the Italian. Thanks for watching. Bye.